Welcome back, YouTube. We're taking a look at some Paldea Evolve today. We got four ETBs in a booster box, 36 packs each for a total of 72. Now, I do want to see your comments below. Let me know which one is going to have more hits and is going to be more fun to open. We're going to try out a new little format today where we're opening up two packs at the same time. On the right side of the screen, you have your ETB packs and on the left side of the screen obviously you have your booster box and we already have a first hit from the ETB side which is the Pikachu EX. Now my money's on the booster box only because Danny Phantom opened a booster box, 36 sleeve packs and six booster bundles to do the same experiment. I'm kind of ripping them off a little bit. Thank you Danny Phantom. Appreciate everything you do for the community. Now he had similar results across all three, which was around 11 to 13 hits per 36 packs with usually either a gold card or two special illustration rares. As we sleeve up our first full art trainer, which is Faulkner. Just as a reminder, guys, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. It really helps the channel if you watch the videos to the very end. And we will be recapping all the hits at the end from both sides. Now, the other thing we want to compare is the quality of the hits, not just the amount of hits. If we get all double rares from the ETBs and we get some amazing hyper rares from our booster box, then probably the booster box is gonna be the better option. But it looks like the ETPs are running away with it and I may have been wrong about this. Let's see what happens. And we got a Meow Scarada EX from the booster box side. We're gonna sleeve that bad boy up. And I really do like the artworks from the sets. That Tyranitar that we pulled from the booster box side is absolutely gorgeous. Cameraman, looking up at Tyranitar from that angle, catching Staravia, hanging out in the background is really, really nice looking artwork right there. But I do stand by my short that I made a, I think a week ago or a week and a half ago where that slow bro hollow, I don't know what it is, but that artwork is amazing. If you have not checked it out, please go do so. I really appreciate all of your support. I think I made this video a little too fast because I can't even keep up with the hits watching it back this way. Let me know in the comments as well if you guys think that this type of video format is fun and hopefully engaging and you're enjoying it. If not, we can go back to just a single camera view. Oh my god, we got a Skeledurge gold card from the booster box side. We're definitely sleeving out that hyper rare. So I think now that the booster box is ahead, even though I think we have more hits from the ETB side, that Skeledurge gold card is a much better hit than all of the others that we've gotten from the ETB side. I want to know if you guys have opened any Paldea Evolved just yet, and if you have, what hits have you gotten? And what products are you opening? I always want to find new and fun ways to open Pokemon. That's why I buy so many mystery boxes. If you have not seen our mystery box videos, go check them out. Yesterday we uploaded a short showing off $550 mystery box from Clutch Cards and Collectibles. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. It's on the shorts tab under our channel page. Now, the other thing I wanna to talk to you guys about is the pricing on some of these cards. I have looked up no prices at all for any singles of Paldea Evolved, but I've said this before and I will say it again, and you can trust me, you can take me at face value, or you can just say, this guy's crazy, I'm not listening to him which is completely fine. But if you are going to buy singles to complete the set, wait out the hype, please. There will be hype around this set, even if it's for 
a large number of people or a small number of people, these prices will eventually go down. It's always the pre-order pricing and the first week or so, but once enough people start opening packs, these prices will come down once more inventory is available for everyone to purchase. And we got a beautiful Meowth Karata and another Ice Cube right there. Such nice looking cards. The artwork on these cards is amazing. Now, I'm sure you guys are tired of me talking and ranting all throughout the video. So I'm going to be quiet and let you guys enjoy the rest of the opening. Enjoying the hits that we get, such as the Wo Chen EX right there and the Pikachu EX. We got two of those and... I will catch you at the end of the video to talk about how many hits were in each side. I'm back. So we're nearing the end of the opening on both sides. And now we're going to take a look at the hits. We got 13 hits from the ETB side plus the promo. Don't forget. And we got 12 hits from the booster box side. And the quality of the hits is very, very similar. So I don't think you can go wrong either way if you want to open up 36 packs. Thank you again for being subscribers. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe down below. And that's pretty much it. We're going to take one last look at the promo that we got with the ETBs. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace out, everybody.